Hi, my name's Kayla and I am a digital nomad. So about two weeks ago, I was on track to signing a year-long lease in Toronto, Canada with two of my best friends. And then as of about a week and a half ago, I pretty much decided to throw all that out the window and put all of my time and effort and savings towards trying to create a life where I could travel long term. The more I thought about it, the more I realized that that was the right answer for me at this point in life and that there isn't going to be a better time to make that dream come true than right now. I have no lease, I have no partner, I have no pets. I have savings as well as a freelance job that I can do online. I have always wanted to travel in a way that's very long term. I've wanted to be a nomad and not have anywhere I call home, but still be able to work and just go from place to place. And right now, this is probably the closest the universe is ever going to get um, to handing me that life on a platter. So I'm going to take it. Um, and <laughs> I am going to absolutely run with that. When I went to film school, I didn't want to be a Hollywood movie director. I went to film school because I wanted to be a travel documentary filmmaker. Five years later, multiple dropouts, failures all over the place, and a whole bunch of necessary life lessons learned. Now we're here again except this time we have the experience and we have developed the mindset to be able to actually do it. I have the chance to do something that is going to get me to the stage where I am basically a travel documentary filmmaker. Even if that's just through daily vlogs of my adventure moving around as a digital nomad, that's okay. If there's anything the pandemic has taught me, it's that everything is temporary and we just have to do the best with the current situation that we're in. In the past, I've spent way too much time overthinking and hyper-focusing on things that are happening around me that aren't things that I actually really care that much about. I'm surrounded by people who have big goals in life to buy their own house or their own car and to get married and start a family. And those are incredible life goals to have, but they're not my goals. So I've decided to fail at one more thing and that one more thing is stressing myself out over achieving goals that aren't actually my goals. I've decided to accept that I feel like bouncing around for a little while. I feel like going on some adventures, not staying in one spot for very long, and seeing and experiencing some of the world. And it's taken a lot of growth and understanding of myself to finally get to this point. But now that I'm here, there's nothing that feels more right than what I've decided to do. So here's to a new chapter in my career and lifestyle. Whether this ends in me traveling for the next six months or for the next six years, I am so excited for the adventures that I already know are ahead of me and for all of the connection that I'm going to find throughout this whole experience. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you all very, very much. Don't forget to smile as much as you can and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Just